you've got players and a league that could be scared for their health or loved ones, I don't need the I told you so. I don't need that from David Price. And this is where David Price sucks. David Price has been a good baseball player. He's obviously a World Series champion. When he came up with the Raves, he was dominant. You know, he has been a really good player for a really long time. But dude, this is so not about you being right. You made a decision and you could feel validated. You could say to yourself personally, you know what? This is the type of thing I wanted to avoid, so I feel good. But read the room and think about your peers. There's two baseball teams right now full of your peers that could be scared to death. There are two baseball teams and their families that could be scared to death. There is a baseball league trying to pick up the pieces who might not make as much money as you do to sit out a full year. And there could be minor leaguers going, well, this is my shot of the bigs. Or fringe major leaguers going, I, I, I got to play this year because this is my only chance. Or I make a million bucks a year, a million and a half. I got to play this season. I don't have $20 million like him per season. Don't tell us I told you so. It is so tone deaf and so selfish and so self-involved. Great. You've got a $200 million contract. You don't need to play baseball. You can step away. Other guys don't have that benefit. Other guys don't have that ability. Other guys could have made the decision to be in it and be scared to death right now. Don't say, I told you so. David Price is just the worst. He is just... Every right to sit out this season. Every right. Don't sit here and take a victory lap and spike the ball in the end zone as the rest of the league now is scared about what's going to happen. 